Hey everybody, welcome to another review. Um, I got a request to test uh, anti-spyware, or whatever you want to call it, um, that I haven't ever heard of or tried. Uh, it's called Advanced System Protector, and it's uh, 29 megs as you can see. So I went and downloaded it. Now I tried to get the, the pro version as a, uh, as a trial. Um, I don't know if I got it or not, so I'm going to have to watch during the install. But other than that, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video while I'm installing and if anything interesting comes up I'll unpause it if not I'll see you after the install okay so it finished installing um, the problem is that um, I couldn't get um, the pro version they don't I couldn't find a uh, trial so I had to get the free version what all, all it offers is uh, scan and clean it doesn't offer any real-time protection so what I'm gonna do is I guess I'm gonna infect this computer and see how well it cleans. I kinda don't like that it doesn't offer real-time protection, but what can you do, right? So let's see how badly we can infect this PC before, hopefully I don't get anything so infected where it just won't, um, that one's dead, where it won't work like we did on the other reviews I did yesterday. Okay, let's see here. Now, I'll, I have to, I'm going to wait for that to see if it works, and I guess it doesn't work. Um, this program does use a, a ton of memory. Um, right now, I'm up to 268 megabytes. Oh, well, there you go. Uh, whatever I got infected it pretty badly, so it's going to automatically restart, so I'll be back when it's done doing that. Okay, so the computer's restarting now. Hopefully, it won't crash again, but it might. It might have an infected... Uh, might have a nasty rootkit on here that uh, has infected one of the virtual machine uh, drivers. We'll see if it fails or not. And yes, it does. So let's see if I can get this started in uh, safe mode. I'm gonna force a restart here. Let's see if I can get this started in safe mode. And no, it won't start. So, you know, I'm not even going to go any farther than this because you've seen, if you look at my other review, where uh, my latest uh, IOBIT Security 360 review, the same thing happened. Um, I got a nasty root kit, and uh, I had to go into a bootable antivirus solution to scan and clean. Um, now, I'm not putting this up against... Um, uh, against the protector because it said it gives me no real-time protection um, maybe if they're willing to give me a key or something I can retest it but as of right now it is what it is I guess you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna see if I can fix that um, driver with Kaspersky or somebody and see if I, we can go from there so I'm gonna pause the video right now while I uh, see if I can fix that driver so I'll be back uh, when that's all done Okay, so I just want to show you here that I'm in the rescue disk here, uh, in the Kaspersky disk, and um, look how much malware it found. These are all pieces of malware, but I'm going to skip them all, and the only one that I'm going to remove is this rootkit right here, because this rootkit is what causes the error 
when I'm trying to boot up into the virtual machine because as you can see it, it infected a uh, virtual machine driver so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna skip all these and that's the only thing that I'm gonna fix and then the rest of them I'm gonna leave them just like they are and from then I'm gonna reboot and I'm gonna give a scan with uh, the software that's on the computer so I'll be back uh, after I rebooted okay so here just to show you as you can see the only thing that I fixed was that rootkit everything else doesn't have a check mark I left everything just as it was okay so let me boot back into uh, Windows and uh, we'll do a scan with the other software be back in a second okay so I was able to finally boot back into Windows and st and be stable as you can see I got a new background uh, your system is infected sign I also got task managers disabled here and uh, let's see if I can if I can get online what happens I know I shouldn't you know what I'm not gonna I'm gonna leave it disconnected first I'm gonna do a scan I'm gonna do a deep scan uh, with advanced system protectors you remember this thing was fully updated so I'm gonna do a scan and I'm gonna wait till this finishes and uh, I'll show you guys what it finds and uh, I'll be back okay so the scan just finished and it found one two three five things or eight infections found some registry registry and two files that's it nothing else so you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna clean it and then I'm gonna reboot and uh, let me do another update here I have a feeling if I connect to the net I mean you can see there's I'm almost sure that there's still stuff uh, infected here I don't have my task manager back I still have this junk in the background so what I'm gonna do as you can see um, I'm gonna go download Malwarebytes install it and do a quick scan so, so we can see what that finds I'll be back in a second okay so the Malwarebytes scan just finished and as you can see it found 61 things so let's check it out and see what it found so let's see we got uh, that one's temporary net files we got hijack right here hijack the wallpaper and everything Coop face, malware traces, rogue, rogues, security tool, root kits. Uh, these are in the temp file though. Let's see what else? We got hijacks, Trojans, Trojans, browser helper object, Trojans, Trojan. I mean, all sorts of junk on here. So, as you can see, um, even. I can't give advanced system protector more than a two and and I'm being nice there um, it didn't okay if, that's fine it was a uh, um, a uh, clean only like what I did with malware bytes here but it didn't even clean worth anything um, you can see task managers back because of malware bytes and um, it finally got its RAM usage a little bit down, but it still got stuff floating around. Look at that spyware one. Look at that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna restart and see what Malwarebytes fixed. Uh, let me pause the video and uh, I'll be back after this restarts. See you in a second. Uh, there you go. It restarted. Um, all the junk is gone now. Um, it's back to using its huge amounts of RAM. Uh, nice uh, advanced system protector if I exit should go away there you go so uh, like I said I can't give it more than a 2 it completely failed to me in all aspects uh, okay fine it didn't protect me because I wasn't getting protection but uh, it didn't do anything for me it didn't even clean up good so uh, that's it, and uh, I'll let everybody go.